Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to talk about how to enter Chinese characters and also emoji in your Visual Studio Code source code. The emoji is super easy, you just install one of the extensions. I use Emoji Snippets, this guy, but there are a whole bunch of others, feel free to explore. With this Emoji Snippet you just type a very simple, you type a colon, colon followed by emoji name, like pile of poo or whatever, and you're done. So how to, to enter Chinese characters again it's another plugin called Google Pinyin uh, once you install Google Pinyin you can toggle between English and Chinese input with a control space so now control space Chinese characters control space again okay so it's very easy now there's a little caveat if you have Vim extension installed, so this Vim is obviously uh, very popular. If you have this guy installed, if you don't know what it is, forget about it. This guy has a lot of shortcuts, uh, hotkeys mapped already. So you, if you have Vim installed, it will intercept control space and you will no longer be able to toggle between English and Chinese. So you need to do something. If you have Vim installed, control shift P, open settings, Vim handle keys. Control space false. This will disable Vim's handling of control space. So you can use control space to toggle between English and Chinese input. Um, of course, I also disabled control W because control W is the hotkey for closing uh, tags, tabs. Yeah, that's why I disabled it because I use control W a lot. Okay, so that's how you enter emoji and Chinese characters in Visual Studio Code. Thank you.